What's up, YouTube? I'm back. I know some of y'all probably at work, school, doing something. But when you get a chance, you get settled, you got your food, you got your little water, your juice, soda, and you're watching TV, check this video out. This video is based on Rashida and Kurt. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I am so tired of Rashida and Kirk's mess. It's just been going on for so long and so many years. I'm over it. Like, I feel like with this new Love & Hip Hop Atlanta, um, Rashida and Kirk scene, um, with the situation, with the text messages to his uh, second to his, you know, baby's mother that he's not with. Um, you know, those text messages that Rashida saw, you know, they all came together trying to figure out what, what's going on. It ain't no trying to figure it out. Once you see the text messages, once um, it's been confirmed that he was texting her f allegedly for more sex, if she wants more money to provide for her son or once you got the proof right there, it's no, it's no trying to figure out nothing. It's no trying to meet up or nothing. You know what I mean? Like, I felt like Rashida is trying to be that really strong woman that just stand by her husband no matter what. And as you can see, when you do that, you're still unhappy. You're still unhappy. You're not happy, but you're still, um, trying to make your marriage work and I get it nobody wants to get a divorce a divorce is not a good thing to me it all depends on how it ends but a divorce thing is not something that I would suggest unless it really needed to happen um, but with this situation this needs to happen it's I'm just tired of the Rashida and Kirk Frost. It's just been going on for so long. Like, that's all I can say. It's been going on for so long. It's like, is he ever going to do right? No. All the stuff we've seen over the years on the internet with the love and hip hop thing, no, Kirk's never going to do right. He'll probably do right for a little bit and then end up messing up again. And how stupid could he be to say that to his... Uh, other kid's mother and thinking Rashida won't go find out. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would you even tell her that? You're a married man. And then when Rashida find out and you looking at her, looking at the text messages, you're just in more in shock as she is, which I feel like was stupid. I felt like Rashida was not mad enough. She was not mad enough because if she was, Kirk would have been done right then and there. It wouldn't even have been no meetup. Well, actually, it would have been once I would have saw the texts and it was confirmed, you know, because that's what she wanted to do. She wanted to see the text messages. She wanted to actually read it. Once I didn't actually read it and I didn't seen what I need to see, it's a wrap. It ain't no, oh, well, maybe we need to be distant for a little while, see where things are going to go. No, those days are over. Rashida and Kirk have been together too long to go through those little stages like that as far as taking a break and all of that. No. Rashida's very beautiful. I always thought she was beautiful. And I just didn't understand why was she put up with Kirk. Why is she putting up with Kirk? Like, you really want your marriage to work that bad? You really feeling like you can't find nobody else? that can treat you better because to me Kirk don't treat Rashida right comment below if you agree Kirk does not treat Rashida the way she need to be treated we ain't talking about money and what he can buy for we talking about actually being there uh, mentally for her and you know of course physically because they married but mentally like really being there really not causing no stress and not causing no chaos he always put Rashida through chaos. He always was putting Rashida through something, allegedly, even though we've seen it on the internet. 
I think Rashida just need to hang it up with him. Let it go. Let him go venture off. He, if he feel like his life is better doing what he do, let him do it. Find somebody else, Rashida. You ain't ugly. You never was ugly. So that's the part I don't get. But I know it ain't even about that. She's just trying to be a strong woman and be there for her marriage. I get it. But guess what? You can't be the only one being there for your marriage. It takes two. And I felt like if Kirk cared, he wouldn't have sent that text message out trying to, you know, get some sex if he send out more money. Because guarantee you, because what the baby mama say, she ain't sleep with him, allegedly. She ain't sleep with him, but she got the text messages to back her up. Okay. But I'm just saying, if she did, if she would have gave in the Kirk offer, Kirk would have took that offer. It would have just been having sex with the BM and still with Rashida as long as Rashida ain't found out. But because Rashida found out, because the BM was talking, and he got back to Rashida, now he want to be at all. He want to be in shock. Bruh, it's done. Storyline of y'all should be over. It needs to be Rashida. The storyline needs to be Rashida that moved on and then, and is following a new journey. How, how much you want to bet you'll get, she'll get more views with that than with Kirk? We just tired of Kirk. I think that's what it is. I, I'm just, I'm over there. I'm over Rashida and Kirk's storyline. I feel like, I always felt like Rashida could do better. And it's like, girl, you just seen the text messages. You just seen what he done wrote to this girl so I hope it ain't gonna be another chance or she forgive him comment below if you think that she gonna forgive him because I'm gonna tell y'all something if she forgive him again you can just cancel it she's just trying to be you know it, it don't matter she gonna work through whatever issue come her way and that's what she has been doing but come on now when you're not really mentally happy, because I don't think she's happy from the stuff that just happened. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would you want to still be with somebody that's not making you happy? Because I really honestly don't think Kirk is making Rashida happy. Not right now, anyway. Not after she didn't raid them Texas. So, comment below if y'all think it's going to be a divorce coming soon. Comment below if y'all think she's going to forgive him. But yeah, I wanted to make a video about that because I'm just, I'm over the Rashida and Kirk storyline. She just needs to let them go. Um, sad, man. It's sad, you know, to see that for so many years. And Rashida, the kind of person to me from looking, she's a different kind of strong. Meaning... If your man do anything to you as far as cheat or, you know, get a girl pregnant or whatever, she's going to work through that to keep her marriage. She's going to work through it. That's a different kind of strong to still go through what you go through with Kirk and still want to make the marriage work and not think every day when you wake up, I can't believe it. I can't believe him. Like, but I'm going to still work through it. That's a different kind of strong. And you got to be very strong to want to deal with something like that. Personally, I wouldn't want to deal with nothing like that. I don't want to be that different strong. I want to be strong like, man, I'm sick of this mess. I'm gone. I ain't got time for this. You didn't put me through too much. Made me look like a fool. I'm over it. But I, I honestly don't think Rashida is at that point to where she's that strong. But she is strong. It's just a different kind of strong. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. Definitely comment because I want y'all opinions about if you think she's going to forgive him or not. After she had already read the Texas child.